Hey YouTube, this is Valerie again from Smellalicious and I'm back. Um, I went ahead and did the piping for my cake and also my cupcakes. Um, this is the decadent chocolate with Swiss chocolate and my cupcakes are the same. Um, now all I'm going to do is sprinkle some diamond dust glitter on top of my cake and on my cupcakes. Um, I'm going to do the cupcakes first because you know you got to lift them up and around so I'm going to do those as I do them over my cake so I won't waste so much glitter. And the diamond dust is so pretty. It's really um, quite lovely. Um, the glitter is really, really, really pretty. And I like the, I like that shine that it gives, that sparkle, because it really does look like little diamonds. I have this glitter everywhere. I really do. Just put a little bit on there. So you know diamonds, I said are a girl's best friend, and our chocolate is a girl's best friend. So why not put decadent chocolate, oh, excuse me, uh, diamond dust glitter on top of these. I guess I'll just do it that way. I think it's working better anyway. I've seen everybody, as well, I've seen several people use the little shakers. I haven't been able to find any of those where I just do it from very high and drop it and then it get on there. But it also gets on everything too. That's pretty. I really like these. These are some big cupcakes too. But I'm not the best piping person in the world. But it looks okay. It gets the job done. Okay, put some on my cake now. I sprinkle it from very high so it won't be globs of glitter. And I'm also going to put just a little of my silver glitter just a little not very much well, that may just add it just a little something special So glad to be back. I'm so glad I got that disc. I have several other um, fragrances that I'm going to be soaping. Also, I moved a lot of my soaps over um, to my 99 cents window. Um, so I have some of my Christmas soaps that's out there that they're now going to be 99 cents because I want to start soaping some other things and I also I'm going to be doing some bubble bars here shortly so be on the lookout for those and I'm going to be doing some other discount things too just because I want to clean off my shelves that's what I do I just after a while if um, you know I have a few bars left I just drop them over into my 99 cents um, window and you know to move them out that way which really works out well because you know we all soap a lot and we all have a lot of soap you know because we want to try different things we want to do different things so we have um a bunch of soap in our inventory and you know it's just a way to get people to or introduce people to your to your product that way also but anyway this is all done. I really like these. Um, they look very pretty with this glitter on them. And I can't wait to cut that one. It's going to 
the cake is going to be really pretty. I have a new cake slicer that I can't wait to try. Um, the one I did, my other cake that I did, that orange Danish cake, I mean, it turned out pretty good, but I freehanded, and it was, it was okay, it was okay, but I actually have a, um, I saw someone use it on YouTube, I can't remember who it was because it was so long ago, but I finally found one on eBay, so once I cut this up tomorrow or the next day, depending on how uh, well it sets up. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and sh uh, shut it down and get these put to the side. I cleaned up most of my mess already, but I have a few more things to get back in place. But I really like my cupcakes. This is this is one of the cupcakes, chocolate on chocolate, and because I ran out of the Swiss chocolate. So this one is just chocolate on chocolate, but that's okay. It's, it's fine. And I'll show you one of the... Swiss chocolate. And I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna cover these up because I don't want them to gel. Because sometimes it tends to, for me anyway, it um, they don't gel very well. So I just leave them out and just let them air, as they say, air cure or uh, set up. But here's one of the uh, chocolate with the Swiss chocolate. And I really hope that that Swiss chocolate doesn't change. I only use a very small amount of fragrance in there and I <clears throat> I don't think it's going to change. Cuz uh, normally it has started to change a little bit in um you know in my container that I blended with. So I don't think it's going to change much. So I hope it does. And I like that. I like that. I think it's really really pretty. So that's my decadent chocolate with the uh Swiss chocolate. I just did a small a swirl around the top of that. So, uh oh, keep losing it. Here it is. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway, so this is Val from Smelling It's just signing out, and I will be back hopefully tomorrow or maybe the next day to cut the cake. And I like my cupcakes to sit in the mold for a couple of days before I take them out. So anyway. I will talk to you guys real soon. Take care. Val for Smellicious signing out. Bye.